So SpaceX just released their official statement, which will probably be the last statement for the night. SpaceX writes, Starship's eighth flight test lifted off from Starbase in Texas at 5.30 p.m. Central Time on Thursday, March 6th. The Super Heavy booster successfully lit its 33 Raptor engines and propelled Starship through a nominal first stage ascent. Approximately two and a half minutes into flight, the Super Heavy booster shut down all but three of its Raptor engines as planned for hot staging separation. Starship then successfully lit its six Raptor engines and separated from the Super Heavy booster to continue its ascent to space. The Super Heavy booster then relit 11 of 13 planned Raptor engines and performed a boost back burn to return itself to the launch site. As Super Heavy approached the launch site, it relit 12 of the 13 planned engines at the start of its landing burn to successfully slow the booster down. The three center engines continued running to maneuver the booster to the launch and catch tower arms, resulting in the third successful catch of a Super Heavy booster. Starship continued its ascent to its planned trajectory. Prior to the end of the ascent burn, an energetic event in the aft portion of Starship resulted in the loss of several Raptor engines. This in turn led to a loss of attitude control and ultimately a loss of communications with Starship. Final contact with Starship came approximately 9 minutes and 30 seconds after liftoff. Starship flew within a designated launch corridor to safeguard the public both on the ground, on water, and in the air. Following the anomaly, SpaceX teams immediately began coordination with the FAA, air traffic control, and other safety officials to implement pre-planned contingency responses. Any surviving debris would have fallen within the pre-planned debris response area. There are no toxic materials present in the debris and no significant impacts expected to occur to marine species or water quality. If you believe you've identified a piece of debris, please contact your local authorities or the SpaceX debris hotline at one 866 623 or at recovery at SpaceX.com. With a test like this, success comes from what we learn, and today's flight will help us improve Starship's reliability. We will conduct a thorough investigation in coordination with the FAA and implement corrective actions to make improvements on future Starship flight tests.